Hey, orange one here, and we're going to be um, pretty much doing what we were doing when we ended the last episode. We are, you know, a little bit beat up right now, but we're not super beat up. Um, got some prisoners, got a lot of troops. Actually, quite a few of them have quite a bit of experience here. Um, we're kind of in enemy territory, just kind of hunting down enemy lords. Actually, sorry, I messed that one up. Um, Imperials, you should try and get them to be legionaries if you can. Uh, the Sari, I haven't really figured out what units I super like from the Sari yet. Uh, and people have been... I've, I've seen definitely with the Batanians that you want them to be skirmishers. And the Imperials, you want them to be like foot soldiers if you can. But um, the Asari, it's basically their horsemen are really fast, so they got good horsemen, so I probably want a number of them to be horsemen. And um, someone put a comment on one of my videos saying that they've got a really nasty, um, whatchamacallit. Oh, you need, a, you need to get some recruits there, lossless. And also, I think, I'm, I think that this is food. Is this food? I'm just going to keep an eye on my food here. No, it's not food. I, I still don't know what that is. Um, I've got a ton of troops that are deserting. That's super weird. I have no idea why that's the case. I think what we need to do is get back out there, though. And um, try and, and get more lords. I... We're going to try and push towards Legata. I think that we've been doing that for a little while now, though. And so I'm curious to see if we're going to be able to pull it off. You look like a special dude for some reason. But you're not. Okay. I don't see the soldiers right now. I must have picked them up recently in-game. Okay. So we're... Oh, we're still at Pen Um. Okay. I could have sworn that we tried to get the Sargot. Did we try and get there and then we kind of got cut off or something? That sounds right, but I, I'm not sure. Let's try and make our way back um, towards the front line. Where is... You're going for Poros? Okay. Well, I'm probably not going to be a part of that, but I can definitely keep the enemy lords off your back. Um, yeah, we can catch this dude. Oh man, this is gonna be easy pickings. This is one of the dudes that we beat in the last episode, actually. Um, that we caught up in the last episodes. Yeah, I don't know what's with, uh, people deserting. I feel like they might have changed something with how things are calculated. Yield or fight. And I'm actually gonna do this because <laughs> you, you are going to possibly give us some good stuff. And I want that good stuff. And Sergeants, take command. Mostly it's gonna be experience, but I think that I could if I take out him, I'm pretty sure that I get a better chance of getting like armor and stuff. It could just be making that up though. God look how fast that dude is going. Like I'm going as fast as I can and I've got like the same horse. Which is one of the fastest horses in the game, by the way. I think it is the fastest horse um, that you can get, but it's not a war horse variant. Okay, yeah, I need to be a little bit careful now. Don't want to be charging into something I can't handle. But that, we can definitely handle. Oh, never mind. My horse is getting tagged by those archers. I think that I can get a little bit closer to these infantrymen, yeah, and get some shots off. Nice. Oh, here we go. Yeah, these these dudes are clearly outclassed right now. Where are you guys going? Is there, is there like an enemy that's trying to escape that way or something? Here we go. <laughs> uh, these archers are gonna need to go, but they're going to take me out when I'm away from my troops. As if we could just get in there. 
Oh jeez, I like wasn't even looking at where I was going. That guy like pretty much killed me. Oh man, that one's gonna be a pain because now I'm gonna be hurting. I'm pretty sure that was the enemy lord. I was like all in the command menu. Well, I need to get married because that could have been game over right there. I don't think that's actually how it works. I'm pretty sure that uh, someone online was saying that the uh, the death mechanic only works for like if you get captured by an enemy lord or something. Yeah, I think that that's good, guys. Yeah, I'm liking this uh, this ratio that we're getting. Any uh, tier four? You got a tier five there. Really? I thought Fians were tier six. That's weird. Oh, please tell me they didn't change the. Uh... Oh, that's an interesting. Uh... Interesting axe. Um. Please tell me they haven't changed the troop trees. I just need to check something really quick. Um, sorry, youths. Yeah, it's a tier 6 unit. Um, what about the Fians? Uh, Fians... Oh, they're, they upgrade to champion versions. I got it. I got it. Cool. Oh, we were also going to see about pressing Dunglanis. I do remember something about that. And, oh, what's this? There's 30... Okay, there's like 70 Batanians out here. Or about 100 Batanians out here. Well, no, not... No, it's like 80 Batanians. Oh yeah, we're gonna... We're gonna just uh, wait a second. Wait for those looters to go down. Yeah, we're gonna... We're gonna totally... Rush these dudes. You know we're at war. And I think these guys might have trash units as well. Is there a way for me to check? They've got eh, not that many recruits. You got a fair amount of volunteers though. I think oh no, I have to send my troops in without myself. Can I just leave then? Yeah. I don't want to send my troops in without me. Not when there's that many of them. I am going to kind of harass, though. Maybe split them. Yeah, let's chase after these dudes. We'll let those guys go off that, their way, that way. I'm getting all thrown off because the Kenshi controls and the controls for this game are similar enough where I'm trying to like spin the camera the Kenshi way and it's, yeah, it's the wrong game. Um, I think I might want to up my charm. Because I think I want to explore that a little bit. Like the charm mechanics. Yeah, I think it would be good to be able to um, get enemy lords to like join my side through diplomacy. Okay, so we're getting near Marinath. Um, maybe I want to catch these dudes. If I'm going to catch them, that is. I don't know if I'm going to actually catch them. And I... I'm kind of going in the direction I wanted to go in anyway, so I'm going to just kind of keep on harassing and see actually if I can catch Varag. If I can catch him, then I'd be pretty happy and be willing to fight him. Actually, speaking of fighting, we probably, yeah, we got troops that need to upgrade. Um, Woods Runners, pretty decent units. We got another crossbowman. Man, these prisoners do not want to join up with me. You know, go figure. Oh, ac what? I guess that we could recruit people there. I was very surprised by that. I'm just kind of checking bandit base. Nah, that's helping me. Why would I clear a bandit base in enemy territory? Just dumb. Yeah, this dude's totally done. Um... How are your troops? I'd like to discuss something with you. Yeah, okay, cool. I got a chance to try and persuade him. Nah, okay. Man, okay, th this is not gonna go our way. 
We tried. Yeah. Um, even with that critical success. Okay. We tried. I tried to save you, man. I tried to, you know, bring you to my side. It didn't have to be this way, man. Take over, it didn't have to be this way. Horsemen! Follow me! Cavalry! Follow me! Yeah, it's a... Uh... I'm gonna hang back myself because, <laughs> like last time, I don't want—I don't want to happen to us what happened to us last time. Oh, geez. Speaking of which, here are a bunch of dudes, and I'm away from the rest of my uh, my troops. Yeah, let's just kind of spin them around a little bit, and then we'll come back to our troops. I don't know what's going on over there, but it looks like their horses are probably going to die pretty soon. Yeah, the, there's a lot of us compared to them down here. There's one of the mercenary cavalry. I'd rather if we were not trying to go up a hill at archers. That's gonna not end well. Hopefully the AI can use the landscape as cover like what I'm doing, trying to keep a hill between me and them, you know? I feel like they're not, but that would be nice. Are people coming? I think they're coming. Yeah, the horses are coming at least. I don't think those are actual archers. Those dudes look like they've got shields. They've got like a little shield wall going. So they're not actually going to be... Uh, Pelting them with arrows. Okay. Well. Let's uh, apply a little bit of pressure then. Everyone follow your sergeants. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll just kind of hang out near the back here. Yeah, this this army is um, way worse than ours. You know, I, I love not fighting uh, fair fights in this game because it's set up because I'm, I'm playing uh, chess essentially right now. You know, we're not really trying to get into a fair fight. We're just trying to um, win the war. And we're fighting them where it's advantageous, you know. It's only as difficult as you make it for yourself with this game. Come on. Okay, we gotta just do it the old school way. Come on. God, this is... My character is so weak. I'm like running this dude down with a sword and it took me like four hits. Oh, Scolder. I've heard of those dudes. They're like uh, mercenary dudes. And there's that group that have that multiplayer uh, clan. I might put a video up with them. Oh, you know what I can do? What I really should be doing right now? Definitely taking all of those dudes. And we'll take them as well. I got really excited about something that I forgot. There's something about units. Oh, it's about the prisoners that I have with me. The lords that I have prisoner. I think we might be able to recruit them um, to join us. Let's let's try it out really quick. Let's go to our our menu. Let's look at our prisoners here. Um, Ceraminus. I could execute or talk to. Uh, I can't try and persuade them to join us. That is unfortunate. Come on, that is a missed opportunity right there. You gotta be able to capture them and yeah. I'm a little bit irritated by that. Uh, let's, let's make our way back to Legata. We'll see. Uh, we did try and recruit from here, didn't we? Yeah, that's the place that we recruited from. There is a caravan that's right there. Um, how are we doing prisoners-wise? We do have 36 prisoners, which is going to be affecting our speed right now. So maybe that's... Uh, 
Let's just tell people to go down towards the Geta from here. And I think that it'd be good for us because we need to um, actually upgrade an, a number of things. Actually, oh, what's this? Oh, you got like almost 30, um, whatchamacallits, recruits. I don't think we're going to be able to catch them. They're a little fast for us. Yeah, they're, we're not going to be able to catch that. Let's get down to the Geta, and then we'll hopefully, hopefully, either find someone along the way that we can fight, or some allies or something. I don't know. Let's see if we get more recruits. Yeah, we are getting recruits here. It looks like my uh, my friends here, they haven't ruined their name with people here, so they're actually able to get some recruits just by going between these villages. Um, well, then I'm going to do that. I know that our caravans are losing troops all over the place, but it's really messing with me, the Kenshi controls versus the Bannerlord camera controls. How is Legata doing troop-wise? I'm just curious about that. Um, 170. Boros has been taken. Nice. Okay, well, we're pretty much where we were a few episodes ago. Is this castle being attacked? I feel like that ca castle's being attacked. Tace, are you about to take that castle? Can I be a part of this? Oh man, I'm literally getting there for like the last few uh, people. <laughs> I feel bad getting any renown for that. I didn't contribute with that. Um, I will try and chase down that caravan. Actually, no, we're gonna see if we can catch that dude. Uh, no. That's not gonna happen. He's way, way, way faster than us. Um, we're gonna go back to the city. We're gonna try to at least get back to that city. Looks like we're going kind of okay. Um, interesting. Where are you going? Well, that is bad news. Well, that city's gone. I think we can pretty safely say. Yalmaris, though, is not um, a lost cause. Why did I just get so much relation with someone? I'm very confused. I'm going to see. I'm going to just kind of... Because that death stack, I don't think there's much that I can do about that. Baragos, where is that? Where am I? I'm over here, and that's up there. They're sending in a big old army over there. I don't know what we have up there, but I'm pretty sure it's not enough. I'm pretty darn sure. Um, there is like 150-ish so of you trying to raid. And we have 100-something people there kind of around here. Yeah, if I can get you by yourself on this little peninsula, then, then he heck yeah. I'm going to go for that. It's all about fighting when you have the majority, right? And I guess trying to charm when you can. No, god, we're gonna need a critical success. Why am I doing such a bad job? I just have had some bad luck with these charm rules. Yeah, even with this, we're not gonna convince them. Okay, well I tried. Yield or fight. And you're gonna, of course, fight. And I'm gonna crush ya. Sergeants in charge! We're gonna just. You know, I've had really good luck with the AI actually taking charge of most of the army. Infantry! After me, pushers, cavalry, and then just telling these guys to follow me. Work, seems to work pretty well. Then I'm able to harass with the horsemen while our infantry gets closer and they tend to get like the high ground and whatnot. As long as we get distracted and harassed with the cavalry, they seem to be pretty safe advancing on them. Where are you all running to? What's with those archers? There's a couple archers taking aim at some people there. We'll just, you know, 
Come over here. Range of skirmishing. Yeah, they've got a couple archers there looking at me right now. We'll just, uh... Oh, someone's lost their horse. Everyone, follow your sergeants. Okay, yeah, everyone... Sergeant time. Uh, I just fell right where it takes me out of the battle, right when we actually started attacking. Okay, we actually are gonna lose some people. Yeah, I'm gonna just do this. I mean, I'm doing good amounts of damage. And it seems to be distracting them, taking the arrows off my brothers. Okay, yeah, we can we can finish off the last lead. Like I've said before, there's something special about running them down in this game. I mean, to be fair, I actually really enjoyed that in like Total War as well. I cannot get the headshot. No. There we go. That wasn't even a headshot. There we go. That was a headshot. And I think that was the Lord. How many people did we lose? 14. Yeah, that's a real shame that we lost so many. You actually had proper troops. Um, yeah, you're my prisoner. I'm not letting the Northern Empire walk around with that many people. Nice work. Got some more units. Uh, let's go... Yep, like that. And we're almost there, come on. Oh look, we've got a battalion scout that wants to join us. Sweet. Cool. Look how much money that I have. We've just been like accruing money over like the years while we've been at war. Uh, 126. Okay, this is an area that does not hate me, so I suspect that I'm going to be able to recruit um, more people around here. Rotate. Did that get taken from this empire? Yeah, there's some interesting dynamics going on with the map right now. I definitely want to get our prisoners unloaded, though, because this is getting absurd. And I think we might even want to make our way to Poros, seeing how um, things keep on going down over there. Um, is it Tavern? Yeah. I don't want to ransom the lords. It's kind of annoying. It, there should be like a little button, ransom all besides lords, or something like that, you know? Oh. Oh, what? That dude's behind you. He's right behind you. <laughs> oh man. Too much sometimes. Um, choose which prisoners to ransom. I'm gonna get rid of... Eh, we'll get rid of our tier 4 units that we've got here. Maybe we'll get rid of uh, some more people. Tell you what, I'm gonna get rid of any Vlandian. No, there's not really any Vlandian units. Yeah, I think we'll we'll keep all those prisoners. Maybe we'll wait for some time though. Nah, we're not gonna wait. I think we need to get more units. Which means we probably need to go to Rote and the various villages around here. We just went to that one. I don't think we've gone to this one, though. And we'll just kind of pick up people and loop back over. Yeah, they're they're doing a good job at, at picking them up for me. But I really need to up our troop numbers if we're going to be making any impact in this continued war effort. I think we really should have probably gone back to um, our home territory. Then we could have gotten some better units. But... We'll, we'll do the quick and dirty approach. So there's an army right there. And there's another army down there. That army down there is probably going to get crushed real soon. Oh, what are you doing there? You're holding. 
well. Um, I'm gonna see if I can I can take you out. Oh man, we're actually pretty close in terms of speed to him, even though we've got so many more people. Um, let's let's see how this goes. Yeah, we'll just follow him, see where he takes us. Cause I think, yep, here we go. Oh no, you don't. Dude, those guys were like your villagers like a day ago. Are you kidding me? Not cool. Not cool at all, man. Oh, another dude that was right by us almost actually got brought into this. Let's uh let's see if we can convince this dude. Oh no, he won't he won't let me. Yeah, I've got quite a few more units than you, so feeling pretty good about this. Man, it's just We've just really been Sergeant, laying out this guerrilla warfare, and it's been working really good for us. Just getting in there and taking out the lords while they're beat up. I mean, we're not taking any cities, but I'm getting a lot of renown. Getting a lot of experience. Me and my, uh, my generals, my companions. I do not like how the uh, horse archers, they, they get just like a little bit too in there for me. Just like in unsafe ways like what they're doing is not inherently dangerous it's just kind of like the angle that they're approaching with it's just not a good angle for like a lot of the things that they do okay these two are gonna be harassing them uh do i want to get involved i think i do oh that guy almost got me oh almost got that guy okay their units are charging it looks like oh nice oh um let's try and get a couple shots on yep oh there we go we got the cataphract just rinse repeat you know just rinse repeat I know that it really would be a lot more effective if, if we were uh, killing the enemy lords instead of letting them go. But I think Radon, he's a. Uh, he doesn't want to kill uh, important people. I, I definitely think Radon's starting to think of himself as better than most. You know? <laughs> he's like a social elite at this point, of the, the sorry. I mean, I've got 200k dinars. Considering how much, like, a cow costs, we're pretty darn rich. Uh, that is my general measurement of currency in any video game, is how much does a cow cost. No, I'm just making that up, but that would be a good measurement. That would be kind of an interesting uh, measurement of, like, different in-game currencies. Well, I mean, the dynamic price changes in this game, so that wouldn't really work well for uh, Bannerlord, but you get the idea, you know. Uh, let's see. Oh, yep, yeah, Expert Forester, Veteran Forester. What are these units? Freebooters? It's like the weirdest unit ever. I like it. Don't get me wrong. I like the name. It's just a little funky. Okay, I'm not going to be able to catch that dude, I don't think. I might be able to, actually. Yeah, I think that we can. Maybe not. Let's uh, maybe get some more horses. I think part of our issue is that we don't have enough horses. That is strange how bright of a green that is. I think it's indicating that it's such a good deal or something like that. We'll take all of those. Take the Sumpters as well. And I think that will change my speed. Uh, not enough by the looks of it. Not enough. Okay, well. Let's go see about getting more mercenaries and uh, joining the war effort back over there again. 
We got a lot of Imperials actually in our party now. My settlement. I have what? Poros is mine? How did that happen? Uh yeah, we're gonna be attacking more than we're defending. And oh wow, we got a bow. Um I think I want the larger quiver because that isn't even working right now. And having a larger quiver is honestly what I would probably go for anyways. Yeah, okay. That looks pretty good to me. And yep, we got more recruits. It'd be nice if there was an automatic way of picking up these uh, mercenary dudes as well from the bar. I kind of feel like I'm hardly even contributing troop-wise compared to my uh, two compa compatriots. Uh, but if you look at our troop numbers, I actually have a good amount of troops. Just these prisoners, these dang prisoners, they don't want to join me. Um, let's make our way. I'm going to I'm gonna keep you with me just for a little bit longer. Just because I think... Oh, yep, yeah, they've taken some prisoner. Boros is probably like being sieged right now. And I don't think we're going to be able to hold it. So I'm going to let them take it, actually. And I've been trying to defend what is, quote, my settlement. Yeah, we're going to go here. This is much better odds of us finding someone. Uh, oh, look, they've gone and taken Garon Tor Castle. Uh, that's going to be an issue for us. And these guys actually like us more, so they're going to actually give us more deals. So I should probably be hanging around here. Yeah, nice. Mercenary crossbowman. Um, you know what? I'm just going to unload all of the stuff that we've been collecting. I just know that we have a lot of it, and that should speed us up as well. Uh... Oh, look, they've got the red prices on the animals now. Oh, thank goodness. I think that that's, that's been something that I've been wanting for a long time now. I'm going to just hang out here for a day and see if we can heal up just a little bit. Yeah, there's a big old army right there. There's 400-something troops. Um, we might want to follow that army and see if we can turn the tide of battle... It looks like that's kind of what those guys are trying to do. There was also a... Oh, look at that. A Dram. If you can uh, try and find that Northern Empire army. Oh no, there's someone who's attacking one of my caravans. We're going to have to buy another caravan. Yeah, I don't know where you're going, but I'm intrigued. A Dram. It says you're going there. Really? Really? It seems unnecessary. Um, I'm going to split off from them. And that immediately is going to pay itself off. Because this dude is toast. Okay, yeah, we're going to go a little bit long. We're going to just take this guy out. Um, unless they want to join me. Oh. Okay. It looks like we, uh, we had such significant advantage there that he was just like nope I'll uh, I'll join you what about you can I do the same thing to you that was really nice being able to just charm that dude uh, okay we're gonna have to work for this one okay I'll take that uh, yep sounds good to me and okay this is maybe i should skip this one um yeah i'm gonna skip that one wait hold on oh what Are you kidding me okay but we gotta kill this dude we'll do that just super quick Come on, come on, come on. Take over, just, command! Honestly, I kind of want to just charge my whole units in there. But I know that's wasteful. Especially seeing how we probably picked up like half recruits in the last, uh, like, two or three days. Like, legit, probably half of our troops are, are recruits right now. Okay, you guys are gonna 
Yep. Come over here. Yeah. Yep. I will. I will gladly play this game with you. Yep. <laughs> oh, horse archery. So fun. Oh, I almost got one of them. Got one of them there. Uh, what about the other dude? Yeah, he's got a nice opening right there for me. There. There we go. Gotta get that horse archery. I think it's safe to say that we've gotten a, a feel for the pacing of everything. There we go. That is what I want to see. Oh, we can't let have these guys getting away. Does it slow you down to aim your bow? I don't think it does. Oh my gosh. Uh, I cannot do the melee as much as I want to just run them down. This horseback melee is... I, I still... I haven't gotten enough practice with that. The archery I have. Archery I'm feeling pretty comfortable with. But not this. Okay. That's looking pretty good. Oh, well, the Lord. We can't let the Lord uh, get away yet. Yeah, someone got him. Cool. Very cool. Yeah, we gotta deal with that stack up there. That's our number one concern right now. Uh, expert th thugs. Yeah, we can turn those to masters. Man, all these thugs. I really should be picking up more prisoners. Oh, look at that. That's a pretty nice, uh, pretty nice helmet there. Yeah, we'll we'll give that to you. Same with those boots. You got all kinds of nice upgrades. Cool. All right, well, I think that this is a pretty good point to end things. I'm just going to really quick just scout this out. Just because I, I need to know. Oh, my God. Okay, we need to take that. That's, that's how we're starting the next episode. <laughs> that is insane. Like, literally insane. Garantor Castle, right there. There's 31 defenders. 31 defenders. Like, are you kidding me? Okay. Um, I'm going to actually siege that down, but we'll end the episode here. Uh, thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.